Hey everybody, my name is Ryan Murphy, here with your fall sports recap. Happy to be talking some men's and women's soccer today. Let's start with the women. The women are off to a very strong start to the year so far. They uh, were a perfect 7-0 and through their seven non-conference games. It was the first time that the team had accomplished that feat since the 2008 National Championship season. This season's run included ranked wins over 19, number 19, St. Louis, and number 22, Wisconsin. That ended up leading to the Irish being ranked number 18 in the latest U.S. soccer coaches poll. The offense was especially potent over that seven-game span with Olivia Wingate and Maddie Mercado leading a team that saw an average of three goals per game. The Irish return home this weekend as they continue with ACC play against the visiting Pitt Panthers. That game kicks off at 1 p.m. at Alumni Stadium. Pitt comes into the game riding high on a strong start to the year themselves. They're 8-1 in their last nine. Now let's turn to the men's side, where the team has won consecutive games for the first time all season, following last Friday's 2-1 victory over Virginia. You might have seen the video online of KK Baffour, the freshman for the Irish, scoring the game-winning goal as time expired. But just in case you haven't, here it is. It's quite dramatic. He's got another touch on it, and has helped clear his lines, and now Rue. Oh, it's on! He's onside with nine seconds! KK Baffour, the freshman, to win the game! Riding high off that momentum, the Irish return home on Wednesday and beat Chicago State by a 4-0 score in the first meeting all time between those two sides. The star of that one was Patty Burns, who had a goal in the fourth minute and put the game on ice in the 75th minute, uh, which is his first two-goal game of the year. It was also especially heartwarming for Burns, whose parents were in town to watch him play uh, in person for the first time in three years, uh, his three years on the Irish team. Burns is from Northern Ireland, so they had a long way to come for that one. The Irish are at home again this weekend. They have a prime time battle against North Carolina at Alumni Stadium. That game kicks off at around 7 p.m. and should be a good one. Don't forget, Pitt is here to face the women's soccer team at 1 p.m. on Sunday. UNC is here to face the men's soccer team at 7 p.m. on Saturday night. That'll do it for today's edition of the Fall Sports Recap. My name is Ryan Murphy, sending it back to you guys in the studio.